Okay, so today, me, my dad and his dad, or well, my granddad, uh, are going to Manchester, to Manchester Arena tonight, to go to see uh, Brian Cox, do a show. It's uh, been planned for quite a long time and we're actually finally going. Because I remember my dad saying, are you sure you're just saying yes because you're just saying yeah? And I said, no, I actually do want to go. I actually do want to go. So, uh, yeah, it'd be good. It'd be good to be in Manchester for the evening. Yeah. So, uh, just taking the dogs out now for a walk. They've perked up a lot. So I just just want to go out for a little walk, half an hour walk, and I don't think we're setting off till like half to three o'clock. So I can do the walk here now, and then take them out later on, depending on how they feel. Pretty sure when it's clear as daylight, like, you don't need your lights on. Just seen one driver with just exactly that. So I'm going out for another walk now, just for half an hour only. Oh, the dogs are feeling much better. This is a good sign, this is a good, good sign. So, literally just going to go over the viaduct. What my neck, dogs, come on. Go to Tesco. Oh my God, I'm getting stuck. I was getting well twisted in the leads. Had to stop. Uh, so yeah, literally just going to do the viaduct, then go to Tesco, uh, get some money out, because we're in Manchester. I mean, I know there's, there's going to be cash points in Manchester, but don't want it to be on my mind about getting something out when I could just get like 30, 40, 50 out now. Plus as well, I can check my uh, like bank balance and just check. And uh, yeah, all good and well. By the way, the walk this morning and the walk now will be its own video, because uh, <coughs> oh, oh fucking hell! Yeah, the walk this morning and the walk now will be one video. But like whatever I do in Manchester, or the lead up to Manchester, will be uh, a separate video in itself. I might not film anything in Manchester at all, but uh, it's just if I end up getting my phone out and something interesting happens, or I just want to have a casual vlog, then yes, I will do just that. I'm not. I'm not going to aim for anything though. So I still want to walk in Torbedon tomorrow and I've made a list, I actually made a list ages ago of if I was to do a 10k in Torbedon because it's something I've never done before, 5k is definitely but 10k is not. Uh, I was like how do I, because for a long time I was just like how on earth do I do a 10k in Torbedon like how do you do that and uh, I think I've managed it. But I figured out and I was thinking like which way to go for it. Uh, I can get off at the station, walk to a place called Rive Rocks, which is where I went a few months ago with my, with everybody, like family, friends, everyone. Um, I go up to the top, then walk back down, which was a 5k on its own. Actually starting from where we're doing and <laughs> So I figured out where I could do the 10k. Uh, I started from my grandparents' house to go to Rive Rocks, but if I started at the train station and then went to Rive Rocks, it would be about 5k altogether. And then I can walk back through Tomerden, Centreville Park, walk around that whole park, maybe once or twice, I don't know, then walk around the town centre. And then there's also a place called Liggett, which is like going out of Torbedon, walked there and walked back out. So I've got plenty of choices now. 
so this wraps up uh, the walk I did this morning or the walk I've just done now so I'm gonna wrap it up now so thanks for watching and because I'm going up to Manchester uh, this afternoon to go see Brian Cox at the Manchester Arena uh, tonight I'm ending it here and whatever I film on the way to Manchester or around um, that time will be its own video so thanks for watching what I did for the first walk and the second walk. Thanks for watching and goodbye.